So hello and welcome on board Finnair's A330 business class guys, that's where I'm sitting right now. Uh, I'm just about to embark on the inaugural uh, Finnair flight from Helsinki, Finland to San Francisco. I'll be reviewing the product today in addition to celebrating the inaugural with Finnair. So I'm really curious to see what this is like. This um, is a variant of the standard um, sort of staggered configuration. Uh, and it's a very different product from what Finnair has on their A350, which I've reviewed before and you can check out here. Uh, if you're interested in seeing what my flight is like, how is Finnair A330 business class, uh, you'll just have to keep on watching. So guys, I forgot to add that I want to give away all this Finnair swag. We have an awesome Finnair A350 notebook, uh, a Finnair A350 plane model, um, a Finnair business class amenity kit from Marimeko, and the business class slippers from Marimeko. So if you want to win any of this, just make sure to share this video on a social media platform. Tag me. Of course, you can share it as many times as you want on different media uh, for a better chance of winning. Um, thanks and good luck. Alright, so here is my seat 4L. Um, all the even numbers on this side of the cabin are by the window and the uneven numbers are uh, by the aisle. And then on the other side there's either group seats of two or throne seats like the one you see in the middle there. Uh, so there's all types of different seats on here. Most of them have direct aisle access which is really great. And I'm excited to settle in uh, for my Finnair flight. Alright, so now that we're on board, let's have a little look around the seat. So this is my view. As I said, I'm in the window seat. Or more of a window seat than the ones in front. Let's close these to adjust the lighting a little. Uh, then over here we have a little pocket with uh, noise-canceling headphones. Uh, which we will, of course, check out in more detail. And all the in-flight literature. Then to my right, all I really have is this armrest. Uh, behind me we have a Marimeko pillow, which again uh, is really great for spicing up the color in the cabin. Uh, an adjustable headrest that goes moves uh, forward and backwards. Then looking down here, we seem to have a very big foot area, uh, which will allow quite unrestricted movement, and I'm actually quite impressed how big this is. And that's generally why I like to choose these seats as opposed to the throne seats on the other side because their foot space is slightly smaller. So over here we have some shoe storage, uh, which is good for a 10 hour and 40 minute flight. Uh, there we go, perfect. Then of course the exciting stuff is all here. Uh, to the left of me, I have um, my little storage compartment with uh, some charging ports uh, for general electronics, USB charging, all that. Then here we have the reading light. And if anyone has ever wondered what this uh, 
green light is, it means that my seat is in takeoff mode. So of course we have the uh, seat button buttons and all that. Uh, and then we have, the seat looks a little worn around here, um, but other than that it's fine. Uh, and yes, this is the tray table. So this will be interesting compare the, to compare the seat to Aer Lingus, um, if you want to check out my review of that up here. Because uh, it's supposedly an identical, almost, configuration, but it's not exactly the same. There are a few differences in the seat design. Uh, then I'm super impressed to see that we get slippers. All right, so let's have a look at our amenity kit. It is from Marimeco, as I said. They have an extensive collaboration with Finair. Finair even has a livery uh, with Marimeco design, which is cool. So opening it up like this. This is what it looks like inside. Uh, I'll show you a little bit um, more inside in a second. Uh, so here we have our sleeping mask. Um, our earplugs, but I will be talking about a little earplug secret I have for this flight in a second. Here's a list of amenities that are available on request, which I think is really cool. Um, and I love that they do actually offer um, some more uh, useful amenities without being too without being too wasteful. Uh, a nice big toothbrush, L'Occitane en Provence uh, lip balm, and a uh, facial serum. And that's it for the kit. Um, and inside, I wanted to show that we have these great little. Uh, pockets, um, which will make it a little more handy if you want to reuse it. So I'm continuing my Finair day with more um, blueberry juice, of course, in the same Itala glasses. <laughs> Some very uh, swaggy slippers. <laughs> so since this is an inaugural flight, Finnair gave us uh, some little gifts from Lumina, which is a Finnish beauty brand. We have a Arctic Spring water enriched facial mist. Okay, the menus have arrived. It's crazy, I've never actually been served dinner before on a flight going to the west coast of the US, but given that this flight probably will serve dinner around 6 p.m. finish time, that actually makes sense.
Wow, I'm impressed they have all these cocktails. And here's all their rewards. Whoa, 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 whoa. Very impressive. Thin air. Nice. So you guys know I love my TV shows uh, when I'm flying. Uh, and I don't generally watch movies uh, on planes. So Finner took me by surprise. Look at all these TV shows. This is insane how many shows they have. And if you just go to, let's say we wanna watch uh, oh, The Big Bang Theory, we have three episodes. What else, New Girl, we have five episodes. Just a huge offering of TV shows. So let's just look at the movies uh, in case, or if you want to see what they have on that front. There's a ton of different movies as well, both classic and uh, contemporary. Well done, Finnair. They also have exterior cameras. They have all these interesting pieces on different destinations. Okay guys, I feel like a kid, I feel like a kid on Christmas. The crew just came around and took pictures with Polaroid cameras and got this great picture of me. I love it. Finnair offer free Wi-Fi um, for one hour for business class customers. Um, and you can purchase more for a very reasonable price, which is great. And the connection is actually fast as opposed to uh, some other airline. Yeah. Also, TV shows um, play the next episode automatically, which is so good. Alright, so the meal service is starting with uh, Finner's signature um, blue sky cocktail and um, some various fruit. We're somewhere over Sweden, I think. This cocktail, I'm not a huge cocktail drinker, but this cocktail is really good. Uh, there's blueberries in it, like, just... I love when airlines, like Oman Air or Finnair, um, you know, offer um, more local delicacies on board. my starter um, with some breads, a pierogi, a little salad. Looks nice. This stuff is amazing. So good. And the main course is served. Uh, I'm not quite sure what this is, uh, but it is a special meal. Uh, and I'll tell you how it is. It looks good. And dessert for me is some fruit. There are uh, several other options like ice cream and uh, some biscuits. We're just approaching Greenland. sent these uh, noise cancelling earbuds by a company called Quiet On. I'm not being paid uh, to even mention this product, but I just uh, wanted to let you know that I'm trying them out. It's a Finnish startup, so it's the perfect thing to try on a Finnair inaugural flight. So yeah, check it out. So it is 
nap time on Finnair. Here is my bed, as you can see. The uh, slightly surprising thing is that the bed is actually not completely life. Well, it is life flat, but it's not like 180 degrees life flat uh, on the ground. Um, it's probably similar to Emirates business class uh, in the sense that since the nose nose is a little bit up, it basically feels like it's flat, even though it really isn't completely flat. Um, but otherwise, I love the look of the bedding, uh, super quirky colors. Um, so yeah, wish me uh, a nice nap, guys. I'll talk to you soon. Flight snacks, Finnair style. I just woke up after um, some great sleep, three and a half hours of deep, deep sleep. And now I have some potato chips, uh, some cup noodles, and some water to mm, tackle my last hours of the flight. meal is served. Um, it seems like I have some sort of tofu curry uh, with a um, slightly less impressive side salad and fruit. Uh, but overall the meal again looks great and I honestly think uh, Finnair has had some of the best in-flight catering I've had in a long time. slowly already approaching San Francisco um, good things always end too soon which is how I feel with every flight I take in business class but this has been a surprisingly good experience I've only ever flown Finnair uh, intra-European before uh, and that was on their E350 so it was really nice obviously but um, I was curious to see how their long haul compared uh, and I was very impressed especially by the food and the service I know Finnair pulled out an amazing crew for this flight and you can really tell um, but also the food was some of the best business class food I've ever had. The seat interestingly um, is uh, maybe because it's a little more aged it's not quite as up to date as some other uh, staggered configurations I've been in um, but I did sleep well um, and of course I have been very comfortable this whole flight having direct aisle access uh, is great and overall it's so exciting that Finnair are coming to San Francisco. They offer amazing connections onto Europe and the crazy thing is that the flight from Helsinki to San Francisco is actually shorter than like all of continental Europe to San Francisco. So in many cases it can actually make sense to connect uh, in Helsinki if you are coming from Germany or wherever uh, because Finnair can take a more northern route and they do have a great product. Uh, I hope you all enjoyed this video and getting to see uh, what Finnair offer on their A330. It's been a lot of fun trying it out. I will see if I decide to review my return flight from New York. Uh, I guess you'll find out by seeing it on my channel. But of course, make sure to follow me on my social media. Uh, I post pictures from my flights, loads of awesome stuff on Instagram. Of course, subscribe for much more like this. And until I see you all next time, fly safe. Thank you for flying.
So I just want to give yeah. you one of these. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, brilliant. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank Take you. Care, guys. <laughs>